Welcome back, this is Baller Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I'm joined today by Vash, Bloon, and Limea. We're just about to defeat the Lavos core here. I believe by the end of this turn, it should be enough damage. Now, when we last left off, we were going through multiple endings. And this is another one, surprise, surprise. For this one, you need to, and I didn't know about this until, you know, maybe a year or two ago, this particular ending. For this one, you need to defeat Lavos between seeing Shala go to the Mammoth Machine in the Sky Palace and Zeal Palace and charging up your pen your pendant which if you remember is like one step right after the other you need to leave the the kingdom of zeal head back to the end of time and defeat lavos in order to get this one this one's kind of a tricky one now if i remember right this ending is not plot relevant which is kind of weird to be honest with you cuz this is kind of a hard one to 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 find to come up with the end! What? This is ending already? That's what that word usually means. But things are just starting to get interesting. Oh, well, come on, folks. Let's do the ending thing. Roll the credits! But first, let's remember all the fun things we did. Okay. Let the ultimate slideshow begin. And it's family reunion vacation photo time. H hooray. First, let's see a close-up of Lean Square. Sure. There's the Steel Runner. I remember kicking many things ass like that. I never understood why anyone would want to run for three hours at a stretch. Forget that. Can you imagine what the inside of that armor must smell like? What a lovely thought, Kyra. Let's get on with the show, okay? <laughs> now let's visit Guardia Castle, your home. Goodness, very nice scenery. I don't see anything. Of course, my dear. Yes, I remember this guy. I guess you never took a shot at him, right? Say, didn't he just wink at you? I can't... I can't see a wink there at all. Relax, Lamia! Hey, it's Pierre! He was, uh, he was uh, Vash's lawyer. If you guys remember. Wouldn't want anything to do with someone like him. Too shifty. He should be put on trial. Course. Come on, Kyra, live it up a little. Let your hair down. Get crazy. She's just got short hair. You're the one with your hair up, actually. Now we have just some random person from 2380. Yeah, thanks, princess. I'll take that under advisement. There's the seed. Hope it grows. There's Johnny. <laughs> Mr. Speed himself, of course. Someone ought to tell him to take a permanent pit stop. Look at that. Really? You're dissing on his mohawk? It's a spiky mohawk, too, isn't it? Hey, check it out! He's really a tricycle! Pa pass him? What? Try again when you learn to ride! God, this is just like gossip girls, I swear. There's that stuffed shirt. Stuffed shirt? Really? Cyrus! He is pretty handsome, though. But where does he buy his clothes? Hey, did you hear? He plucks his eyebrows! You've got to be joking, but he's still a hunk. What? What are we talking about here? Hi, Toma! Now, he's definitely my type. Really? This is just going to become, let's look at all the hot guys in the game, even though they're completely whatever. Ah, he's just a flake. Probably has a dozen girlfriends. Actually, I see him more of an intellectual. Yeah, this is just gossip, isn't it? What about him, that Kino guy? Total Neanderthal, throw him a bone! But he's honest, that's kind of attractive. He walks like a duck! What kind of duck do you see, Kyra? Seriously. I don't see anything. Well, he'll never hurt anyone. He's really very gentle, isn't he? Oh my god, Vash can talk! What the hell? What kind of voice do I throw for Vash? What are you two doing? I thought you said something about a nice little slideshow. Flash! So, we got a little carried away. 
Where do you want to go next? Someplace fun! How about into the now? Now is in the present? Okay, let's go back to the present, sure. Why not? So I guess we don't need a gate key anymore, right? Hey, wait a second! <laughs> Fash can't talk? What the hell was that? The end. I don't, I don't understand what that was. And yeah, that's the full end. Now we're going to the PlayStation version credits, which are the same no matter what. So that's going to do it for this ending. That was the craziest ending I, I think there is in the game, to be honest with you. We might see more crazy stuff later, though. But that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I have been Bala Scuba. I've been joined by two girls who like to gossip. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching. And welcome back. This is Bella Scuba with an episode of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. When we last left off, we saw arguably one of the worst endings. I, I feel free to say that. Worst endings of the game. Today we're going to be doing something a little different. We have just taken out uh, the Lavos core yet again. I'm joined by Novin, Fash, and Jojo. Now in order to get this particular ending, you have to have Jojo with you because you have to do this immediately after you beat Black Tyranno. But before you see Shala uh, go into the, uh, the Ocean Palace room in the back of the Zeal Palace, whatever that room's technically called. I think it's the throne room back there. I forget. And then we get a plot-related ending, I believe. This one is plot-related. Because we do need some of those. Because if we stop and beat Lavos here, that changes the timeline. You know what I mean? Some things need to change when we do that kind of stuff. What? Are you kidding me? Akira Toriyama. Okay, he did the character design? Isn't Akira Toriyama the same guy that did Dragon Ball Z? What kind of ending is this? You can't just end it like that. If this is going to be another short ending, I might as well just merge the, the this one and the last one together. Because the last one I know was uh, relatively short. So we have... Novin walking up to the statue of Magus? I mean, Luke? <laughs> well, technically, when we see the statue, he's still Magus. So, yes, what happens? <laughs> Come on, tell me! What happens if we defeat him without ever going back to 12,000 BC? Because, to be honest, I'm not a big fan of 12,000 BC. It's a long way to walk around. If you can't tell, I'm trying to uh, do endings from the furthest along in the plot and then slowly work my way back toward the beginning of the plot. And that way, uh, I have the fullest opportunity to level up as far as I can because leveling is going to be something I'm going to need to do. Why the little kid Tata was allowed in that bar, I don't know. Hey, there's two Janices there. No kitty. I am no longer the boy that you knew, Kitty. I am now a vampire. Hey, if anything else, this is a good way to get people to at least watch all the way through the credits. Because there are little cutscenes and then a little brief... Yeah, <laughs> then we got the, the names going up. It kind of forces you to at least sit here. You may not have to read all these names like Fumi Nakashima, Tadahiro Usuda, but at least you're here. And that's all they can really ask for. Oh snap, Jojo is the best. What does he say he drinks? Lemonade? Yeah, lemonade drinker ever. Nah, she loves beer. You got, you, that, it's got to be beer, doesn't it? You can't have alcohol in, in Super Nintendo games. But still, it's beer, I swear it is. And then Luke goes down by himself. Advertisement? Really? 
You're giving credit to the marketing people? You're not even giving them their first names. Coordinator. Shouldn't that have an O at the end, not an E? Coordinator? I don't know. And we're all sloshed at home with multiple kitties. How did I get all those kitties? <laughs> I don't understand what's really going on here. We're all in uh, 1000 AD. The gates don't seem to have gone anywhere. They all seem fully capable of transporting people around still. Unless JoJo's trapped with us. Oh, there we go. If history is to change, let it change. If the world is to be destroyed, let it... I didn't catch it. If my fate is to be destroyed, I must simply laugh. Okay. I'm coming, Lavos. Uh, and uh, that's the slowest walk up ever. Isn't that where the mammon machine was? I don't know. I've played through this game like six or seven times. I still don't know every little detail, to be honest with you. Uh, at least uh, they're getting shorter, my little playthroughs and preparations and all that kind of stuff. But I do want to show all the endings. The end? But we don't know what happened. We we don't know what happened. How can that be the end? He walked into where he said Lavos was. I assume the Mammon machine was in there. Maybe Lavos was in there. Unless he went through the Black... No, there's no... Uh, yeah, and unless he got through the Black Omen somehow. Because the Black Omen is the Ocean Palace. But really? That's the end? Yep, that's the end. So that's going to do it for this part of Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I've been Bala Scuba. I've been joined by everybody because everybody was in that cutscene and everybody was drunk. Hope you guys have enjoyed this part. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.